This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. It's Borussia Dortmund. They face Paris Saint-Germain, and it's coming up live here on EA TV. Well, this is a region that really loves its football, the industrial west of Germany. We're at the home of Borussia Dortmund. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And tonight we've got the semi-final of the Champions League coming up for you. It is Borussia Dortmund against Paris Saint-Germain. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Daniel Malen. Borussia Dortmund have given it away. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side, Marcel Zabitzer plays alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And Niklas Füllkrug is up front. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Lucas Hernandez in central defence. Vitor Ferreira starts alongside Fabian in central midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today is Kylian Mbappe. Well, you get the feeling so many in attendance here have come just to see this man, Kylian Mbappe. Yeah, he's a real handful, particularly when he's running with the ball. And, of course, his finishing has been so clinical. That's why he's their leading goal scorer. Kylian Mbappe. And a tidy challenge. It's a good Dortmund move in the making. Can he do it to take the lead? Must be... Well, getting in the way, superb save. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, not cleared away completely. Danger averted for now. Lucas Hernandez. Went in strongly, decisively. Oh, nice work to get past his opponent. And plenty of space for this Dortmund attack. Zabitza. Can he put them in front? Oh, and it goes! The opening goal! A long way from being decided, but it could be telling. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. But I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. Now, PSG get the ball moving again. How will they respond? Well, they have the ball once more. Plenty of support here. Oh, tremendous vision. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And that is going to close the book on the first half here in the Ruhrpott. Well, very influential in the first half, Jadon Sancho. How would you sum up his performance? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. away once again and the onus is on PSG to turn this match on its head
Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Space afforded PSG. Mbappe. And this to level it. Well, not quite the result he was hoping for with that shot. Close, though. Well, it's frustration for the manager. That should have been the equaliser. Ian Matson. Can he find the right pass? Foiling his opponent completely. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Kylian Mbappe. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. And into the last 30 minutes now. Sancho and players waiting in the centre and everyone in the centre looking on as it sailed over them just cutting off the supply now can they counter clinically Mbappe well, it petered out. Brandt. Emre Chan has given it away. And passing it through. Still can be dangerous. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, when you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to the attacker, and the finish is excellent. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. So underway once more, 2-0 the lead here. Dembele. Here's Marquinhos. And Fabian. Mats Hummels with that important block. Substitution it is for PSG. Corner awarded to PSG. And short it is. Still looking for space. And disappointing that it's gone out of play. And no nonsense defensive clearance. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defense. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Oh, the threat is there. He's foiled them on his own. And so the referee blows for full time. Borussia Dortmund are the team carrying an advantage going into the second leg. Well, it was a great performance, wasn't it? You could see the game plan from the first minute and they executed it so well. Surely they'll be moving into the final with another display like that. Well, Stuart, he really has had a lot to say for himself out on the pitch. 
Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.